Have you seen the new Ninja I have not, Turtles? have you? It is, yes, it is I've just... Heard, I've heard bad things. ...the worst. Just incredibly awful things. The, um... Uh oh, there's someone out there still. Each of the turn. Oh. 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 Down you go. Nice. I was trying for a stealth, ki uh, isn't stealth there kill. One? Didn't quite get the stealth silent kill, but I knocked it. The... Yeah. How do you feel about April O'Neil? I have nothing against April O'Neil. Do you think that? A movie where April O'Neil is the central character would be more interesting than a movie where the Ninja Turtles are a central character? Probably not. Do you think that April O'Neil should be to kill Shredder? No. Does, does she kill Shredder? <laughs> well... SPOILERS! She kills Shredder. Please do not reveal the incredible secret of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Go ahead. I anticipate anybody who wants to see it has seen it by now. Uh, but it like like I realized that um, it's the same thing as the Michael Bay Transformers. It's that the humans are the central uh, characters and not not the characters. people, the, not the not, not the much cooler beings the movie is supposed to be about. Yeah. Unfortunate. So, I mean, I can understand, like, because the CG budget yeah, is expensive. Sure. But I don't like, know. You know, the old it's like April. the old original live action Ninja Turtles movie was costumes, and they looked pretty good. You, you know, I remember. I, you've, you've seen that movie, right? Yeah. The yeah. first Ninja Turtles movie, I think, still stands up. Secret yeah. of the Ooze doesn't, and Turtles Three is just. Was I like I I could t I knew that was awful even as a kid. <laughs> Secrets of the Ooze is that the one with Kevin Nash? Yeah, he's he, he's Super Shredder. Yeah. And that's the one with Vanilla Ice. Yeah. Go Ninja, go Ninja, go. The third one, I'm convinced the third Ninja Turtles movie was not even a nin was actually just a completely unrelated script. That they shoehorn the turtles into. I would. Because I mean, not it's just about like you know someone from present day going back in time to you know feudal Japan. Nothing particularly to the turtles about. Yeah. Uh oh. Speaking of sewer creatures. Maybe. Oh. Really? They vomited right through that fence. Ooh, but that grenade got him. The grenades are really handy in this, and they're they're, nice. they're easy and fun to use. I played some games where the grenades are just kind of I can never hit anything with them, but this one, they're great. Hmm. Swim. I do think it's interesting how your vision inverts in color beneath the water. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it doesn't really have that sort of, like, sepia tone that Dark Vision Above Water has. Yeah. Alright, that's got all eight bone charms. Nice. So in Low Chaos, is this just, like, a pool? Like, are there, like, kids swimming here? <laughs> I think there's still river crusts, although maybe not as many. But, I mean, this is still, it's still an unpleasant place in low chaos. But there are actually, like, people still right. alive who aren't, you know, incurably sick. They're, they're, they're shreds of hope, you know? Whereas here, there's just nothing but des death and desolation. Yeah. Is that dude who's totally dying in, uh, that we visited earlier? I went back and watched that video. Um... Hmm. Where we watched that dude die for like five minutes and then we're just silent. Which? Oh yeah. Um. I th in the yeah. Oh, are they district. still there? Is he still dying? Uh, I. It's been a what? Yeah, I see. It's dying been a while. Long. I don't recall. I don't recall. Mm. Yes. Off 
far now. So we're exit. Door to the hound to the hound pit pub. Victory! Oh, nice. The flooded district. Down the back door. What's it? Sixty-eight hostiles killed. Four civilians killed. De 15 dead or unconscious bodies found. Chaos high. Recovered weapons and gear. Help Slackjaw defeat Granny. All five runes. All eight bone charms. All three Sokolov paintings. The Outsider Shrine. 4,306 4, out of 5,635 coins. There's a lot to find in this area. So now it's on back to the Hound's Pit pub where, as you may recall, things ended a bit acrimoniously in our relations with the Loyalist Conspiracy. Has some uh, strong words for that bartender. Actually, we know who poisoned us. It was Samuel. Well, it was Samuel under coercion by the others. Remember, he saved our lives. Or our life. Right. He, he see Well, I'm, I mean, we know who poured yeah. the poison in. But it was, I mean, we saw it was Pendle you know, the Admiral, Pendleton, the Admiral, and, you know, Martin. They were all in on it, as we saw. Right. Samuel, in High Chaos, Samuel is pretty disgusted with you, but he has enough... He still had some residual loyalty to you that he, he he refuses to actually murder you. He says he uses like half yeah. the amount of poison. He, he intentionally was yeah, to. he underdosed you. And then on low chaos, he he um and he saves you. Well, you he know? he still gives you slips you the poison, but then that's because he wants to save you to help because he, he likes he actually cares about you. Oh, look who's here! You, right. Thank the stars. Oh, hey. We all thought you'd been killed. Hanging out. Except for Samuel. He seemed sure you'd survive. I saw him on the river shortly I wonder before the began. He was smart enough not to come ashore. That's a cool I hat. I he's still out there. Looking for you, is my guess. Yeah, it looks like a newsie's cap. The block called us into the yard. But I wasn't feeling well. I just watched from the attic. The Admiral brought his cutlass. He stuck Wallace through the eye with it. Then he did Lydia. Calissa he shot in the back with his mm. pistol. Murdered them all. Emily saw it all. Havelock kept yelling something about the things he'd done and how no one could ever know. Pendleton weren't even looking anyone in the face. They said it was time for Sokolov and went off to his cage. I don't know what happened after that. All the, you know, little people involved. Emily was the there loyalist conspiracy. The started. Mm. Poor child. I hope she hit her eyes. The Admiral said that... So, do you know... Do you know why she's alive? And they started yes. to worry they'd get executed for all that they'd done, going after the Lord Regent and his allies. I suppose it's why you want to elaborate? You too. She might actually say it herself, but... Oh. I thought Lydia would squeal on me at the end. She just told Havelock to screw himself. And died. She hid and... Lydia, what a hero. One who ever showed me any kindness. Yeah. I don't think the Admiral... Actually knew I she hid and Lydia refused to rat her out. I can hide here for as long as it takes. Um, no well, safe. so no do you know why she was able to hide? Well, she's got this little hidey hole over here, I assume. Uh, Wallace, I believe, the guy who is in charge of just the staff of yeah. the house, um, was to distribute oh, yes! orders telling every That's everybody right. to, to gather in, um, in the yard for meet their out. like severance bonus or something. And he told her she wasn't yeah, getting... Yeah, their bonus for their she loyalty. Told her, he told her she wasn't getting anything. Now, was yes. that intentionally to try to protect her, or was he just um, being a douche? And didn't... There's a lot of speculation that he did it intentionally. Uh, you know, we right. can't know for sure, because there, there's also... Um, like... You see a lot of instances of, of him, like, just not being right. nice to her yeah. in general. But... But... It also seems that he knew that everybody who was going outside would die, and he at least had the decency to be able to spare her. Obviously, people like Lydia uh, and more of the more notable staff members couldn't hide. Well, it's like she said, it, it seemed like Havelock barely knew she was there. Okay, now the place is under heavy guard. Yeah. I believe I get it. Grab it later. There's she actually. You, if you leave and come back here later, she's gone, but she's left a note. Closer, ever closer until uh. let it out. What's so impressive? Now, important difference. In low chaos, Callista is not killed. 
couple of noblemen? Lydia and Wallace still die, but Callista does not. Well, now I do hope he shows up. And she, and if you if you save if you saved her, um, and she'll appear in the ending. And if you saved uh, her uncle earlier, they'll appear together in the ending. Oh. There's nothing you can do to save Lydia and Wallace, though. That is a shame. Is it kind of like Lydia? Yeah. I mean, she had very little interaction with you in general, but... She was kind of... She was cool. Yeah, she was kind of... He says the outsider follows poor crotchety, but she was a good person. There's some curse on this city, that's for sure. I don't imagine anybody working for this conspiracy be that cheerful. in a plague times not being yeah. crotchety. Yeah. few bottles of wine from the cellar. Just take them out of your way. Just make sure Corvo's not hiding down there first. Maybe you're right about that guy. There's a couple ways you can do this next phase. Because you know, it's tricky to get... You can't just... Needless to say, you can't just stroll across that street. Right. Obviously. And it, it's kind of, you know, this, like, ledge, the uh, little walls there. Mm. Um, yeah, I've got some rooms to uh, use. Devouring Swarm. Now you can, each of these skills has how many level ups? They each have two. Just two? They each have two levels. Okay. It looks like you get all the skills. Well, you can't. You you, you can't. There's I'm not, not sure. enough rooms in the game to bring everything up to level two. Uh oh. Okay, now I can stick rats on people. And I've got a more powerful wind blast. And more health. More pop. The high-powered wind blast. You wind blast a guy, and he hits something. He can literally like tear apart. Like, he hits, like, a, a railing and, like, his legs will break off. And now that little barrier back there, you can't actually really hide behind that because the tall boy will see you. Oh, I see. I mean, you can hide behind it for a little while until a tall boy gets runs by, but it's not a... It's got, I keep forgetting the range. Well, oh, there you go. Alright. Uh, don't... Is this your house? Don't, don't mind me! Your, your housewarming <laughs> gift for her. I'm sure she'd have preferred a plant or something. guy we gotta worry about. Sure enough. But there's a lot of them. Now that's one way. Potentially getting across. And for cross, make the mad dash. Another way is... Mm. Which I actually tried to do, you saw me screwing it up, is possess one of the guards. And then you can right. walk across. And then, like, and then ideally try to, like, get into an isolated place where you're not seen when you pop out of him. One way right. to do that, you can't attack guys when you're possessing guys, but you can open doors. So that side door along the pub, you can go in there, and not far from there, there's another door that takes you into, like, the stairwell where nobody is. So that's a good spot if you want to get inside the building quickly. And there's no, like, um, Hitman-esque suspicion mechanic, right? Um... Well, they will, like, people will, they'll, 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 they'll notice something is wrong with you. 
like if you're possessed, like they'll say, "Hey, you look, you, you don't look well, buddy," or whatever. But they it, they don't actually yeah. figure it out. No. Even if you go somewhere that your AI wasn't before. No. That's cool. This is, this is, it's inter this is an interesting stage just because it's a place we've been many times before, but never as a you know, never it was never a place of danger before. So it's a little it's a little discon it's a bit disconcerting. Right. No, like no, it's it, a good though. thing. Yeah, it's a good thing. Um, it's an interest. Yeah, it's definitely a cool game design uh, tactic. Kind of throws you off your balance a little. It's disconcerting. Yeah. Speaking of, there we go. Oh, I got some nice, nice. distance. Now. <laughs> now, there's some futzing around I did in the water that you're not going to see most of. Because it's really not worth seeing. Now back to our program. <clears throat> I have to say, the blood on your sword stays really fresh. Yeah. Once you kill someone in a stage, it's on for the rest of the stage, I believe. I mean, once you kill someone with the blade. I'm surprised they had the good sense to go around and lock everything up. I guess surprised is not the word. I'm mm. impressed. Place is under heavy guard. They probably didn't want to take any risks. Yeah. To the roof. Ah, back to my room. Oh, there you go. 